Youths, they say, are the leaders of tomorrow. It is therefore important to nurture and mentor them ahead of future leadership position. How prepared are the youths of today ahead of the future challenges? Let's find out in this report. And high to hand is the devil's workshop, so goes the popular adage. It is no longer news that youths across the country embarked on nationwide protests. What is new is the way forward on how to prevent future reoccurrence. When we create employment through this type of model, farms, give all the basic amenities there, and everybody will one way or the other be employed. If the welfare is well taken care of, all those things are themized there, we'll have covered everything. Whether health, whether uh, education, name it. Despite the fact that the protest was married in Nabekuta, the Ogun State capital, stakeholders believe that some of the youths are Haidu and therefore advocate that they should be positively engaged. To mitigate acts of juvenile delinquencies in the country, elder statesmen acknowledge that technocrats and political leaders have greater roles to play in mentoring and nurturing youths. Nurturing should be from their words to local government before it comes to state and national. So nurturing them is what their leaders in their respective places tell them what to do. So the technocrats have to formulate a very good policy that will be able to sustain youth development. While blaming the family and the society for youth restiveness, religious leaders say proper mentoring from the cradle is the way to go and therefore appeal to the youths to shun acts of violence. Our mothers, do they have time for their children, for their baby? No. At times it is difficult for the baby, for the child to recognize the father. It can lead to death. An untimely death is not what you have been praying for. Please don't participate. Stakeholders unanimously suggest adequate sensitization of the youths on the need to embrace dialogue rather than engaging themselves in acts capable of causing violence in the society. In Abelkuta, Akim Jimo, NTA News.